Okay, so, you know, it's new phone today, so that, that means new comic book. And as kind of a break from last week, I only got one comic book. Last week, I well, showed you a total of eight comic books I got. Eight being that I bought six. I can, I can use my fingers to count. I got six through Comic Cartel, which is a really good site. You should check it out. I'll leave a link in the description below. And they just came in that week. I didn't pay for them that week. But then also I got two at the comic store. So, yeah. So this time I only got one. And this week I got Flash number 50. It's a dollar more expensive than it usually is. I almost said cheaper, but that's not right. That's not the right thing. So instead of $3.99, which I believe it usually is, it's uh, $4.99. I think that might be because it's uh, number 50. I don't really know because I knew they had. I think they had a big thing for number fifty for Superman. So I guess it's. It doesn't really exactly seem thicker, but it might be thicker than usual. Maybe. Mm. But so I got number fifty, the story arc that they started two issues ago, which I read all at once, and then I reviewed them all at once, which I will leave the description, uh, the link to that video in the description below. Uh, th it started, and I like this story arc. I really do. It's pretty interesting, to be honest. Like, it's really cool. I like it. It. I'm pretty excited for it, but not to the level of excitement as I am for, like, Vision, um, Bombshells, and, uh, Miss Marvel, because Miss Marvel's doing pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty great. So, you know, only one issue. But I do have a little, not really a story, it's just a little quick thing that it just weirded me out. When I went to the comic store today, I went maybe an hour later than usual because instead of going right after class, I decided I'm going to come home, I'm going to relax and eat lunch, and then go to the comic book store. And so that's what I did. And so then when I went there, well, like, if you don't, can't tell, I'm dressed up. This is actually a dress. This is a... And I just felt like being girly today. And so I went, I was like walking up, getting out of my car, walking up to the store. And one of the owners, because all three of them were in today, one of the owners, like, I guess he might have just been near the window or something. So he saw me coming and he just like opened the door for me. He's like, hey there. And I was like, hi. It just, it just creeped me out. Not creeped me out because like, they're all cool and whatever. It's just, it was, <laughs> it was weird to have the. It just, he just might have just been around, that's why he did it, but for me, I was like, why are you holding the door, this is weird, is it, is it the dress, am I, is it the power of the dress, the, the power of femininity, femininity, I think, I don't know, that's, femininity, femininity, <laughs> no, but it's just, it, it's just, it was just a weird moment for me, and I felt really weird about it, but it happened. It was, it was kind of funny, because they were talking, he was hold. not only was did he hold the door for me, I'm sorry, m one of the weird reasons, because he was holding the uh, Infinity Gauntlet, like, they just have, like, you know, collectibles and stuff like that, and so he was, not only, he, like, saw me through the window, I saw him, like, eye contact through the window, comes and opens the door, and he's got, like, the Infinity Gauntlet, and I'm just like, what are you doing? <laughs> it's so funny. It's they were rearranging a bunch of the new merchandise they have, not just like because new comic books and because they got more than they had previous weeks. They had to make room, so they had to get rid of the stuff that they had on the shelves and move them around. And I guess he had to move the Infinity Gauntlet, and obviously like people were buying stuff, so they had to make space and then take up the space that people bought stuff and then they got new merchandise like they just got a lot of game of thrones merchandise like funko pops and everything like that which i was looking at them they look really cool but i'm afraid to get them because i don't watch the show so i don't know i might but also i might want to just calm down with buying funko pops because i have one space left uh, but, you know, aside from Funko Pops, because it's not new Funko Pop day, it's new comic book day, so, what did you guys get this week? Uh, did you guys check out comic book, car comic cartel? Because, uh, they're really cool, you should, because they're cool. They're really cool. Do it. <laughs> Sorry. 
they're really cool and I just thought you should check them out it's really nice for back issues like buying older issues or even like you can have a subscription through them so like they'll send you the comic books for that month or that week send it to you so you won't have to go to the store but you know going to the comic book store is kind of half the fun so you know do whatever D do you you do you oh uh, what besides what you got what series are you reading because I'm thinking about picking up a new series and I want to know what's good I might want to branch out a little but I also might want to just go with the type of stories I'm going with already uh, as just a refresher I'm reading Flash uh, DC Bombs, Bombshells, Hellcat, uh, Miss Marvel, and Vision. I think that's it. It's really bad when you only read like five and you can't remember them all or you think that you might be reading more. Oh, Spider Gwen! <laughs> I remember now, sorry guys. So I'm reading those ones. So suggest any ones but those and I might check it out. You never know. Okay, so. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. So, you know, bye guys.